probably familiar as this 2-0 pitch is driven in the air to center field, but it will slice over to Ashford Fulmer in center for out number one. Hit it with the first pitch to Mac William. He swings and he hits it hard to Monty on one hop. Fire to second for one. The relay to first. Double play. A 5-4-3 twin. 1-2 from Longville. Swing and a miss. Rice has to pick the ball up from the turf. Throws it down to first base. Here we are. Good catch. What a great throw. Here's the payoff from Longville. Called strike three. Freezes him with the heat. Longville's 0-2 pitch. Swing and a miss. Tipped by, by the hitter Atwood. Rice hangs on. And that'll play. Started 26 games. Mr. Vance lines this one to center field. It's going to drop. It'll be cut off by Atwood. It fires it in, holding Sir Vance to a single. And Fulmer gets the stop sign over at third. 1-2 pitch. Look hard grounder into left field base hit. Rice scores. Here comes Vidalis. He's heading home. The throw will come into third. It's a two RBI single by Jacob Campbell. And the Cougars are in front for the first time. Two to nothing. It comes in a 1-2 count as Campbell hits a hard. A one from Nixon. Long lines this one up the middle. Diving effort by Farney, but it's by him into the center. The 1-1. Breaking ball, swung on, blooped towards left center field. It's going to drop for a hit. Here he arts around third. He will score. It's an RBI bloop single by Corey Jolks, and it's now a 3-0 Houston Cougar lead. Here's the pitch. High pop in the air to right. Cervantes drifts back a few steps to the track where he will make the catch. The Cougars win. A complete game shutout by David Longville. Gives the Cougars the 3-0 victory and their 30th win of the year.